Oh, 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 we have a friend here. He's gonna bite us right in the ass. No. No, I'm gonna cut you! I'm gonna cut you. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is Games Kicks and welcome back to Subnautica. You guys wanted to see everything, so I'm gonna keep as much as possible in it, unless I get lost somewhere and I have to go on a massive grind or something like that. Look at him! Look at this! Ray Ray! He's a happy fish. Ray Ray is a happy fish. Now, this is Ben, our trusty little pod, Ben. And I think we, g we gave things names before, and I think we had Susan somewhere, but I don't know if Susan was the voice or if Susan was, the sh was my ship. I I'll remember. This is Ben anyway, my, my escape pod. Now, what we have to do in this episode, we're going to have to get some salt because we're going to have to start building at least a minimal one room base. And that is because our space is limited. Yeah, we need to start building something where we can store all our junk and start hoarding it. Yeah, so we are going to have to get quartz and we're going to have to get some salt and we have to get some silver. Silver is going to be exciting because silver is going to be basically in the kelp forest all the way on the bottom. So we're going to have to go diving, my friends. And we also need a couple of mushrooms. We need, um, I think we have one back home, so we need three. Ah, sure, why not? And we need a couple of copper ore as well. Oh, look at that. There's something to scan. That's cool. Let's do that. Okay. Oh, there. Right click. So, Seamoth fragments you used to be able to pick up in the past, and you had an analyzer, basically, a machine which you built, an analyzer which analyzed them. But you don't have to do that anymore, you can just scan it now, which is brilliant. So, let's see, we want to make sure we have enough room. I also need to keep looking for that crash powder. Oh, brilliant, another thing to scan here. Nice. Oh, that is brilliant. Once we have the Seamoth pieces scanned, we actually should be able to build a Seamoth once we know how to build a constructor, but we get all there. I know, thank you. That is Susan. Yes, the voice is Susan. Thank you, Susan. You are brilliant. I don't know, I just picked a random name at the time, but I want to stick with the naming conventions that I gave them originally, so that, that that's that. Okay, thank you. I need some air. Here we go, and back down, because we are going to have to go down here now. Um, you guys also confirmed that I was looking at the right place for the crash powder, but it's sadly on a very low uh, percentage, so that's why. Okay, so let's see what we have here. We need salt, but we also need... Oh, that's good. Primestone. Oh, that's titanium. Oh, no, whoa, whoa. We need sandstone. So we're actually wrong here. We need to go with where the ground is red. Oh, this is deep. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Don't you come after me. I'm gonna have to cut you in the face. Okay, come on. I have to orientate myself. I keep getting... I'm keep, I keep losing direction, so I'm, I'm not very good with that. So I have to go over here closer to that, I think. So, the red forest should be over there. And we need to keep an eye out for salt. And we need some copper as well. So these guys here will have copper or... Oh, it has a... Oh, look at that! I can scan it. it should... Oh, no! Whoa! Can I scan that? No. Oh, crap, 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 crap. No touching, no touching. I'm allergic to touching. Oh! This is getting scary now. You are being scary. I could have scanned the actual limestone. Yes, but we are, we are correct here now. Whew, okay, so we're on the right track. So now we just get a little bit of air, and then we go straight back down, because there's some bubbly stuff down there we can breathe in. So let's see if we have... Okay, we have enough room, because we have to get a couple of silver. Might as well get more than one while we're there. Oh, this sand thing is there, though. Which is really annoying. So let's catch some bubbles while we're going down. And... Oh, we missed that one. Yes, nice. And here's the other one. Okay. So let's see if we can find some sandstone. Oh, there's sandstone. And we can scan it as well. So let's scan the sandstone. Now, sandstone chunk doesn't give you titanium and copper. It gives you... It gives you instead a chance on silver. And... Um, I forgot what the second one... Are these guys actually friendly? Because that would be pretty cool. 
Yeah, I think he's friendly. I could be wrong, though. I don't know. He's so far not attacking us, which is pretty cool. So let's just get a couple of air bubbles in. Okay. And hopefully he will leave us alone. Well, he seems to be leaving us alone, which is cool. Okay, so let's scan. Let's actually quickly read the entry point for um, life forms, fauna, acid mushrooms, boomerang, no, flora. Where does it store that? Planet geology, there. No. Okay. I don't like this. Why does it not show me this, the sandstone outcrop? So silver and gold. So it can contain silver and gold. Oh, there's another one of those guys. And we have to be careful. And we have to quickly go and find some more air bubbles. They're so hard to spot these sandstones. Warning, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna have to go back to my safe bubble. And then we're gonna have to get some sand, uh, some, some salt. It's very hard to get salt. I don't know. Am I looking in the wrong biome? Is salt actually... I don't know. Okay, so come on. Emergency. There we go. No, it's not an emergency. Don't worry about it. What? Did one of those little bloodsucker things attack me again? I don't like them. They keep biting me once and then they, they run away. There. Ah, gotcha! Ha, got you right in the face. How do you like them apples? Yeah, not so brave now when you're dead. Okay, so let's go. And find... Oh, yes! Thank you! There's some salt. And we have to find a couple of more sandstones. Again, a lot of you seem to have not played this game before. So, you were asking to show everything. And that's okay. I just thought that by now everybody would have seen this game. And again, I read the comments. Let me know in the comments. If you want me to start skipping things and uh, grinds, then I do that. Absolutely. Okay, so now we have to... Oh, there's a fragment, is there? Ooh, what fragment are you? A terraformer fragment. Nice! That will let you uh, change your surroundings, you know, a bit like crafting things Warning. like, uh, sorry, oh, limestone chunk. What did I get there? A titanium. So limestone is titanium. Okay, I think we're gonna head back. We have everything we need, I think. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna make it on time. This is going a far way up. So we're gonna make a base. The plan is to Emergency. make a... There's Ten another... Yeah, yeah, remaining. yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, you, you can see it getting dark now. I don't want to lose all my items. Everything I collected now, I will lose if I die. Yes! Whoo! And just go quickly down here. There was another um, fragment. And there's some salt. Is this salt? Is it salt? Yes! Ha ha ha! Gotcha! Because we need to make with some bleach. We need to drink some water soon. Otherwise, we're gonna have a problem. And that's another... Oh, do we have all the Seamoth fragment pieces now? Oh, that would be nice! That would be so exciting! Oh, we're missing one more! Oh, that, that, this, is, this is amazing. So, let's pick that up. Oh, actually, we can scan it. Oh! You, I already scanned you. Don't be so greedy scanning you twice. Warning, yes, yes, yes. I have to check my inventory. Okay, I don't have room to pick up any more scrap. Okay, we're gonna have to go back to our bubble. And... Oh, there's another fragment. Hopefully that's the Seamoth fragment. Yeah, okay, we got our air. And now down. Quick, 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 quick. And is there any salt? Can we spot any salt? If you guys know where to find salt better, or more, let me know, because if salt is that rare, nice! If salt is that ra rare, then we have a problem. Because I don't think stuff respawns in this game yet. Yes! Oh, awesome! Okay, so let's go back, see if we can find some more salt on the way, and we're gonna go back to see what we can build now with this. Oh, look at that. This is beautiful. Oh, tunnel! I'm not gonna go into that now. We need more crash... meal. Oh, sorry, crash powder as well. I know, that's why I got the salt, dude. That's why I got the salt. I think we can eat these guys here as well. Creep vine. I think they give us a little bit of water as well. Come on. 
There we go. Oh, 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 we have a friend here. He's gonna bite us right in the ass. No. No, I'm gonna cut you! I'm gonna cut you. Yeah, I cut him. I cut him as well, so he was afraid. He, he, he kind of run away now, yeah. You better run! Okay, so let's see if we can eat these guys. Uh, they give us a little bit O2, so eat them, eat them. Nice. So we got a little bit of uh, hunger and thirst back, which is brilliant. So let's cut another couple of them here. Never cut the ones that have the 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 baubles on them. Oh, I. Stay blood loss detected. Oh, why blood loss? Whoa! Oh. Okay, that's not good. Am I bleeding? Why is there blood? Oh, it's getting dark. Why is there blood loss? I'm confused. Oh, I'm scared now. It's getting dark. That was... That, I was... I, that was confusing. I thought I was supposed to be able to eat the... Vines. Hmm. Maybe they damaged me if I eat too many of them. That's probably it. Okay, so we can scan this guy here because we haven't scanned it really. Nice. Yes. Okay, so we are back here. That will save our inventory, which is good. Inventory secured on the top left. You can see it. Now, let's craft really quickly some bleach. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I need to... Why can... Oh, come, Coral. Seriously? Seriously. Now you... Oh, man. Common Coral. Common Coral. We have a peeper we can cook. And we need one common coral. There we go. Let's take two and see if we can make two drinks. Come on. Bleach. And we make one more bleach. Then we're gonna go here and then. Woo, okay. So let's quickly cook the peeper. And let's quickly make some disinfected water. And then let's eat and drink so we're gonna eat the fish which gives us good and then drink that Whew, okay so we need to do more water now yeah so maybe in future episodes once you guys are getting used to all this like I'm gonna I can cut out making all that so I do I will just basically um, you know do an, a grind one big grind of camera once I have the wardrobes, uh, the shelves and everything, and then I just fill up things with water and with food. Well, with fish, because the food will go off. Okay, so, what we need to do now is we want to make a builder. And what we need for the builder is we need some of these corals, actually. Sorry. We need a few of them. I don't know how many. So, we need some silver ore and some copper ore. We don't need salt. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to make... A habitat builder. The laser cutter is new to me as well. I don't know what it does. So I can't wait actually to see what it does. So if you guys know, leave it in the comments, you know, let me know these things because last time I played it was when they added, um, I don't know actually, it was two updates ago anyway. So not the, I didn't play this one and I didn't play the one with the added rack. It's the one before that I played last. So a habitat builder needs a computer ship and batteries. To make batteries, you need acid mushrooms and a copper ore. That's why we collected the acid mushrooms. And to make a computer chip, you need a table coral sample and a silver ore and a quartz. So we collected all these for that exact reason. And how do you make first aid, actually? You have to look at that equipment. There's first aid. We need a creep mine sample and bleach. Ooh, that means we need salt. And the creep mine samples is the ones we ate. So they hurt us and they heal us here. So we're going to have to probably go out and get that at some stage as well. So let's make the Habitat Builder. Brilliant. Now what we can do with the Habitat Builder is now we take... Let's take the these guys out. Let's put that in there. I don't think we need quartz. I'm not sure. Let's take these guys out. What do we need for glass? Because we're going to need glass as well. So do we need for ore, do we need class? Let me just double check the fabricator. Glass, 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 glass. 
silicon glass it needs two quartz so we do need quartz for glass okay fair enough again i don't think spawn uh, quartz and all that respawns which is gonna be a bit painful so you're gonna have to go on long grinds eventually outside your comfort zone into different areas so let's make some glass because we're gonna need it okay now let's get out oh i'm healing actually oh that's brilliant Ooh. And with this habitat builder, what you do is actually let's wait until morning and um, I'm gonna go and catch some fish and eat some more food and drink. Okay, guys, so we are not looking for our dream location yet. We just literally, you can disassemble bases again, so it's not too difficult. So, what we want to do is we want to just find a spot possibly nearby because we're still gonna have to, uh, to do a lot of looting here and there seems to be a nice bit of uh, caves down here or canyons or whatever so we should probably stay here close by first okay cool so what the, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the build tool for the people who don't know this yet and you right click and on the right click menu you see these habitat, habitat compartments power appliances so this is all for internal stuff you know to make things fancy some of them are functional like lockers and war lockers and some of them are non-functional like in that sense they just have a bench you can sit on it an aquarium looks nice a picture frame you can make a picture and put it in there a screenshot um solar panels is what we need to power actually so we need to pick up some quartz and foundation is what we need first so the foundation is what you pick up and you go where you want it and place it so in the moment let's just stay near our oh okay i'm running out of air yes 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 susan i'm sorry thank you for reminding me susan susan likes me to live which is good so you don't need necessarily to build a foundation you could theoretically build a multi-purpose room straight away and oh maybe we do that actually yeah why not let's just let's just do that actually Oh, and can we hide it here? Is there is there a cave or something? Is there is there a hole underneath here? Yes, there is. So we can move this boat. Oh, there's a crash thing. Oh, that is lovely. So we might actually just build the room. Exactly. Let's do that. Let's just build the room. End of story. We don't need a foundation. Um, there's some things you might have to do with, inter with internal integrity, but we'll see. So let's build it right here, I would say. On this little edge. I think that that would look nice. There you go. And the way it is, you press left and then you will start building it. And then it uses your resources as you continue clicking left and finish it. And that's it. Now it's done. Finished. Dusted. Okay. And now we still we need to make a way in. So we're on this side, which I want the windows. And we make an entrance here in the back. Let's make an entrance here in the back. And the entrance will be... Where's our entrance? Where's it gone? There. A hatch. It takes titanium and glass. So you can go on any of these parts. It will automatically um, attach itself. And we just want it here. So it's going to use the titanium, then the glass. And it starts using the resources from your inventory. You can see it here. So we have no more glass. Oh, we have two glass left. And now we can go inside. Just press um, left mouse button. Hi, Susan. Thank you for welcoming me aboard. Now, we have no power in here. So we get air, but we have no power. So we can't power anything. If we build a fabricator now and put it on the wall, it won't work. But we're okay for the moment. We don't need power. But what we do need, and we do need it sooner rather than later, is extended storage. Because we want to go on grinds, on um, loot runs for certain things, and store them somewhere. So the best way to store things is with lockers. So let's build, we can start building a locker here, for example. Come on. Uh, oh no, I have to go left. There we go. I would like to build it as far as possible to the back. And there you go. It's taking a glass, it's taking the titanium, and it finishes. Now, to open it, you left click, and that is all the storage you get. Isn't that awesome? So we can put our peeper in there, we can put our food in there. So that can be our food one, okay? Now, you can build these guys as well for storage. Nah, uh, uh, wrong one. Here, right click. The wall lockers. 
but the wall lockers they um, have less room but they have a label on it you can put a label on them i don't think you can put signs on lockers no so if you want to label what you have in places you can use these little wall lockers and sometimes the, these little guys are actually much handier because you see the way they're smaller you can fit three of them on a wall in, and here you can only fit two so you do end up with more storage possibly i am not sure i haven't counted it really but we'll see so let's go out let's get some quartz and oh no if you press e to deconstruct it you get your materials back so you don't lose them which is great so let's um yeah that's it we don't need to leave anything in excellent and when you leave it store it saves your it should oh it doesn't have any power we need quartz to give it power and once it's an operational base i think it saves your inventory as well as you go in and out so let's get some quartz and then make some power okay so i just got uh, went into ben and uh, ben gave me our uh, quartz it ha he had stored so let's choose our builder right click oh right click and let's go to power and let's build some solar panels and let's put them right here on our roof i think that would be appropriate um one should be enough in the beginning it takes two quarts and that will give us power now of course this will store power and it will not give us power at night time so in the moment the, there you go and you can see now we have four out of 50 power one power uh, one solar panel gives us 50 power if we build two we have 100 power and of course during the night then when there is no power coming in it will use all the power so when you then end up um say building something with a fabricator the problem is that you're gonna lose power and then it won't build anymore if you're out of power so but you can also i think did they remove the batteries because you used to be able to build um batteries to store power now that's all gone so it's just solar panels now is it oh yeah that sucks anyway no harm done so we want to build a window if we can oh where's the window here we have two class and let's build the window right here and look at that here we have a nice view outside which is lovely and that's it i what i like to do usually is i like to uh, build um, a locker for uh, food and a locker for my ore that's that's what i like to begin with and i built two lockers two big ones anyway and then i can let's see if i can build a small one actually let's because we can fit three here if we have three here let's see how much room we would get let's just do that on camera okay so if we have two lockers beside each other we have one two three four five six eighteen thirty six 72 so we have 72 slots and that times two so it's 144 slots and if we have this oh no i don't want to change the label this is one two three four five it's only five across 10 20 30 so that's 30 60 90 so it is actually better to have the two big ones in that case absolutely so oh this one is going off is it Oh, it's gives us not minus nine drink now. Well, we're gonna do it anyway, and um, then we drink something. There we go. And we're gonna take this one apart again. So we hold E, and you see you get the resources back, and that's it. End of story. Brilliant. Excellent. I'll leave the episode here. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And to anybody who is not new to this game, uh, I'm only gonna probably do it for the first couple of episodes to go through everything, and. Um, then oh look at the abyss and in the next episode we're gonna do something that makes us go faster by the way i found out earlier when you scan again a seamoth fragment but you already have them all scanned look what happens you get two titanium so it's not a waste it's not a complete waste anyway Ooh, what is that oh lovely that was pointless Excellent. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, remember to kick that like button in the ass. Like a G4K ninja. And I hope I see you guys in another episode. And until then, viel Spaß and happy gaming.